I love when people double words to make a word mean something it was supposed to mean already. <laughs> My friend does this all the time, but a little bit too much. I'm like, did you eat yet? And he goes, well, I ate, but I didn't eat, eat. <laughs> well, that's fair, but they're like, well, then, so you're hungry. Well, I'm not really hungry, hungry. <laughs> it's not that I'm not hungry, I'm just not too, too hungry, you know? I'm on a diet, but it's not like a diet, diet. And I want to have fish, but it's meat. I'm a vegetarian, but it's not really meat, meat, right? <laughs> right? I'm just not all that hungry per se. I love when people use per se. What they're really saying is, whatever I just said, not even really true. So you're lying. Well, no, it's per se, man. It's that gray area between truth, truth, and not necessarily true. I love when people use necessarily. So you're, you are lying, not necessarily, no. But you are. Well, you know, I'm, I, I am, but I'm not lying per se.